Hello, uh, today I'm going to show you how to solve the integral of x3 times e with the power of minus x2 dx. Okay, so you can solve this integral uh, by um, combination of the substitution rule and the formula uh, for integration by part. Okay, so if you define x2 as let's say parameter t, therefore 2x dx will be equal to dt. Okay, so let's rewrite this integral as in a sort of x3, I write here x2 times e minus x2 times one more x here because we had here x3 is x2 times x is x3 dx okay and then now if you substitute this uh, expression into this integral you can rewrite this integral as in a sort of x2 i write t in a sort of e with the power of uh, minus x2 i write e minus in a sort of x2 i write t okay and in a sort of x dx here you see here 2x dx is dt therefore x dx is 1 divided by 2 dt so in a sort of x dx here i write 1 divided by 2 dt okay so now you need to calculate basically this integral okay and this integral you can calculate it by um, integrate by the using the formula for integration by part that is uh, basically integral of u dv is equal to uv minus integral of v du okay so using this formula you can calculate this integral so to do so let's define 1 divided by 2 times t as u therefore 1 divided by 2 dt will be equal to du and let's define e minus t dt this term as dv therefore v will be equal to integral of e minus t dt which will be equal to minus e minus t so if you now substitute basically this uh, equations this this expression into this formula you will get this integral will be equal to uv u times v u is this term v is this term so that will be minus 1 divided by 2 uh, t times e minus t that is uv minus integral of v that is this term times du which is this term so minus times this minus is plus okay uh, v that is e minus t times du which is 1 divided by 2 dt okay and this integral will be equal to that it will be minus 1 divided by 2 t e minus t and in a st the integral of e minus t will be equal to minus e minus t okay and so 1 divided by 2 is constant so minus 1 divided by 2 e minus t okay plus c which is the constant of the integral if it's not clear for you how to calculate the integral of e with the power of minus t dt just write from in the comment section and i will explain for you how to do that so at this stage all you need to do is now to substitute this parameter t with the definition of the t okay and the t was defined as x2 okay so therefore from here you can uh, conclude that the integral of x3 e minus x2 dx will be equal to minus 1 divided by 2 times t uh, which is x2 times e with the power of minus t in a of t i write x2 minus 1 divided by 2 e with the power of minus again t is equal to x2 plus c which is the constant of the integral and that is the solution to uh, our integral i hope you found this video helpful if you're interested please feel free to subscribe in this channel so that uh, you get updated when i upload new videos thank you